Hi, my name is Melinda Calway, and this is a cottage scene I'm painting. First of all, I painted the daylilies in the foreground so they can dry, and while they're drying, I'm painting the sky, wetting it first, doing a wet and wet technique, and then throwing in some blue colors. And while it's still wet, I'm going to be painting the trees that are furthest away from us, so they're in the background or in the midground, and painting them wet and wet, they stay lighter and I'm coming forward and painting the trees closest to us, a little bit darker in value, which gives us that illusion of depth or atmospheric or aerial perspective. Putting a little bit more detail into the ones that are closest to us as the viewer. Putting a little bit, of, a few lines in with a credit card, just scratching the surface to make it look like there's some lighter colored trees in there. Now I'm putting on some masking fluid on those foreground daylilies so that I can paint around them easily or paint over them. Putting in some water in the mid-ground there. And uh, while that water's drying, I'm putting in the wonderful lounge chairs in different colors. Putting a little bit more color on the sides there and painting the dock in there. While the water in the dock is drying, I'm putting the foreground green in uh, the grass, painting around that fire pit. And now I'm starting to paint some of the trees that are starting at the top and coming right down into the foreground. Taking my time doing these trees, putting a lot of detail in them because they are close to us and want them to look interesting. And interesting shapes with interesting negative and positive spaces within them. And there's quite a few trees along the side there. Some of them are uh, lighter in value. Some of them are not as light in value in reality, but I'm putting them light as artistic license to differentiate between the different trees. And this is a uh, tree on an island in the background, which I really quite like, so I'm painting that in. And the foreground trees. A little boat and some of the uh, docks in the background, the floating rafts. A little foreground tree. You see the flag is already painted in, and this tree that's closest to us is just hanging over and framing the picture nicely, mm -hmm. uh, putting in some dark branches in there too, and some branches here and there and the other things. Wetting that foreground again and putting in some uh, dandelions, and just doing some final touches. It's just about finished, taking off the masking fluid. Thank you very much for watching. hope you enjoyed this.